Hello, my name is Troy Singleton and I'll be praying for us today. Before I do, I want to tell you a brief story about Jesus calming a storm. The story can be found in Matthew chapter 8 verses 23 through 27 and Mark chapter 4, 35 through 41 and Luke chapter 8 verses 22 through 25. One day after preaching to a group of people, Jesus said to his disciples, let's sail to the other side. As they were sailing, Jesus went below and fell asleep. Before long, a storm came and beat upon the boat until the disciples were afraid that they were going to die. They went below and woke Jesus up and said, save us, Lord, we're going to drown. Jesus got up and said to the wind, peace be still, and the wind ceased. This story shows having God in your boat doesn't mean you are not going to face any storms. However, you have peace in knowing the storm would not sink your boat. Let us pray. Father, we come before you thanking you for your grace and your mercy of this day. Thank you for health and strength and allowing us um, to be well at this particular moment. We lift up our leaders who make the decision that govern so many people's lives. And we continue to ask for your protection over the essential workers who are providing care and, and supplies to, to people who are sick and food and everything in between um, during these perilous times. We ask for your guidance for those of us who are to stay home and um, to allow this virus to run its course and to come to an eventual end, that you would give us peace in dealing with the, the everyday life of not having any place to go and, and nothing to do outside of our homes. And we just also want to ask for your guidance for our, our ministers and those who are leading churches who are thinking about opening up their services this Sunday, that they will seek your counsel before, before making those decisions. And we just ask that you bind the, the, the attacks of the enemy as we continue to try to heal our land and that more people will come to know you in the midst of, of this time. And we just thank you for this day. We thank you for your, your grace and your mercy. And for giving us strength and we ask for your continuous blessings in jesus name we pray amen have a blessed day